said before. This game is horribly broken. And I'm not just saying that. Uh, you know... Oh, I, you wouldn't oh. think this. I, 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 this. There we are, ladies and gentlemen. How are we all doing, my brothers? How a single chat like you is doing today? Today, we're going to be listening to the cries. We're going to be listening to the toxic gamers. We're going to be listening to the Call of Duty refugees and the Call of Duty beta testers. One in the comments if you bought the game. Two if you didn't. Like the video. Subscribe if you're brand new because a lot of brothers are mad right now. A lot of brothers looking like this and and the homie Blame Truth be promoting that retard helmet. I want to see him promote that one more time. Let's see if he does or not. I mean, I should expect this. I really should expect this. But you wouldn't think this because 90% of this game is, is already recycled. done for Sledgehammer. Yeah. How true, could they true. mess stuff up? Let me just give you guys a quick... Let's be real, man. These are some of the most incomp... This is incompetency at its finest, bro. All the Modern Warfare 2 multiplayer maps. Guess what? They were already made. Zombies. There is no zombies map. A war zone, all of the war zone was pre-made and the war zone maps are being used for campaign and multi- and in the future will be used for multiplayer as well. This entire game is recycled and the fact that it's this broken crazy. A little rundown in case you're stretched for time, but um, EOD, the perk EOD, just flat out does not work. Uh -huh. Nero approved it in a video, I think yesterday. It, EOD <laughs> doesn't work. The, the entire Shenma. perk is worthless. It gives you the icon, but it doesn't actually do anything from what I saw. I've been hearing that Ghost doesn't work. Ghost just does not work at all. I, I've been hearing that constantly on Reddit. I haven't seen anything official. I don't, uh, I haven't had time to watch exclusive Aces videos. Maybe he's covered this. I don't know. But from what I understand, does the minimap work though? Because it feels like that they were like, "Well, we're gonna bring all the features that the community asked for." Guess what? Like the uh, ghost doesn't work, guys. If you want, <laughs> you know, the, the, the the stuff they said they're gonna bring back by the looks of it, it doesn't work. Absolute clownery, bro. Understand? Ghost does not work, man. Uh, a lot of people complaining about it. Yeah, Challenges to yeah. unlock stuff does not. <laughs> this doesn't work. The better you do. The less you win, you're gonna see again. I, I, I've lost so many matches. I've been on the top of the scoreboard. All my matches pretty much, or near the top, and we've still lost. What do I have to do in these team games? And don't tell me to go play. You need to give them 70 more dollars from your wallet. A free for all, the spawns are so bad. I would rather stick my dick in a meat grinder than yeah. play free for all. Nah, bro. I mean, damn, bro. Nah, bro. Okay, that ain't it. Cut it, bro. Cut it. Cut it right there, bro. Like, that ain't it, though. This game. I saw people on my reverse boosted account, like, spawning in front of me on Wasteland on a free-for-all. I'm not making that up. No. Mm-mm. Sorry. Mm -mm. Not gonna happen. Really? The better you do, the better you do, KD-wise, the less you're going to win. Yeah. You guys true. can post your like actual KD and win loss in the comments section, by the way, because I want to do a little experiment. I actually, I actually truly think the worse you do, the more you win in this game. The un that is facts, though. <laughs> famous, famous, but true words. Okay, and I don't want to say famous last words because these are not last words. These are the words that we say every single time, every single year, and this is gonna blow your mind. Okay. Uh, this might open up your third eye, guys. Everybody gather on, okay? Emergency meeting real quick. Have you ever noticed, though, every single year, the complaints are the same. Game's broken, comes out unfinished, comes out filled with microtransactions, right? Everything... Suckers complain about everything. But there is only one thing that's never broken. Can you take a guess right now? Think a little bit harder right now. Just think a little bit harder. Get your overclock keyboards right. There's only one thing! That is never broken, despite everything broken, despite suckers complaining about everything, despite uh, the skill based man dragon, uh, you know, uh, friendly UAV online uh, skin. There's only one thing. Take a guess. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. That is the store. The Call of Duty store that Activision loves, that is very dear to their heart. They, they, they have it here. They make sure they never let the thing go. Everything everything might be buggy, but the store will never be buggy, guys. The store will always work. You put in like two dollars, 
it will make sure it will give you one dollar worth of content uh, obviously in real life it's like zero dollars content the content don't matter in real life but, but but still though it will make sure it will empty your wallets it will steal all your monies it will steal all your v bucks ma 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 student muffins out there my single chats unlock stuff be away be away it's it's un it blows my mind it blows stay away, stay my away. mind but let's get back to the perks here all now right. now let, let me let me take you guys way back all right oh damn Th these iterations of the perks were were pretty much perfected in black ops 2. do you know when black ops 2 came out 20 goddamn 12. that's when black ops 2 came out in 11 damn. years in 11 years why have we backtracked on something as basic as a perk not it is crazy that these devs have been making the same games every single year and the, the fact that they are messing this bad on the perks so the perks are a core feature for call of duty how can you mess that up when you have been making ever since the original modern warfare one though you know what I'm saying? And they perfected and they enhanced that in Modern Warfare 2009, Modern Warfare 2, the original. And ever since that, bro, like, they have been dropping perks, maps, weapons every single year. The games are coming out every single year. It wasn't an issue all the way back uh, during Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, though. But I don't know, man, these last few years... I, I guess it's the diversity hires. I, I, I would have to take a guess. Maybe they have been supporting and trying to just... Uh, put this as precedence where you know the, the the blackrock the vanguard the esg score that's that's taking precedence right now that's the only thing they are putting first that's what they care about by the looks of it so obviously diversity hires uh talentless diversity hire obviously that if you're gonna go all in on that then obviously your games are gonna turn out to be crappy not just as basic as a perk but, I mean, perks have been a thing since 2007, if you really want to get into the nitty gritty. You know, like, I mean, flag yeah, jacket's yeah. been a thing since 2008. It worked oh, no, in World at War, Damn. why doesn't it work here? The first iteration of Ghost was technically UAV Jammer, and, yeah. and that was in COD 4. Why are we having these issues? And the, the, the scary thing is, the scary thing is, is that I, I was on Twitter and- Yeah, friendly UAV Jammer. I saw Marksman tweet out like, hey, like Mar <laughs> Marksman has direct contact with the devs. Marksman has been trying to, you know, get Infinity Ward to change stuff and fix problems all year to no avail. But before... Mar Let's be real, bro. Like, if you're expecting YouTubers to change the game, like, I mean, you're just, uh, like, that. that's a hope. That's a dream that will never come true, though. Like, twats, these twats, I'm talking about Activision and, like, Infinity Tart, um, these twats invite YouTubers out, streamers out, to promote the game, right? They promote the game, okay? They're also like, we're listening to your feedback, give us your feedback, give us your feedback, we're gonna be listening, we got, look at, look at us, we got the pen and pad in hand, we are listening, we are very eager to hear your thoughts. YouTubers, streamers, uh, paid influencers, shills, and, you know, some good, uh, you know, Call of Duty players in between as well, or good gamers and streamers, uh, kind-hearted people as well, in between, everybody in between, we have seconds that don't give a damn, and there are seconds that give a damn, okay? They give them their feedback. Guess what they do? They write it down, and they throw it in a trash can. They don't care. They don't care. They don't care, though. YouTubers give them feedback. Segas give them feedback. You guys are constantly giving your feedback. You're constantly telling them what you like, what you don't like. They don't care, though. They don't care. Modern Warfare 3 released, Marksman and I think a lot of his friends said, hey, like, EOD doesn't work. And he had to tweet Sledgehammer, and he's just like, hey, I've been telling you guys this since before the game came out, Bruh. and the game's come out, and it's still <laughs> broken, and it's not on your Trello board. This this is all just it's it's just bro. Even if you put on even if these uh, twats put in on the uh, uh, on their Trello board, it doesn't mean that it's gonna get fixed though. It's Vanguard they don't care. all over again. It's just Vanguard all over again. How Vanguard can I how can I sit here and want to play a game yeah. with two fundamental perks broken? Seriously. The only other thing that I don't understand after this one is that how can you sit there while promoting this uh, retard helmet, blame truth? 
You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't get it. I don't get that either. Well, how? Why? Why, why? why would I want yeah, to play this? Yeah. Why would I want to play this? Let, let's take it a step further, though. Why those are, are two big problems, and I mean, those are big problems. Those are, are essential perks, man. Like, for the enjoyment of a lot of people, those perks are essential. Am I telling lies there? I mean, if you've played Call of Duty for any amount of time, whether you're a veteran or, or even just maybe you picked up the game in, in 2019 with Modern Warfare 2019, I don't know. New, old, like, you know that these perks are quintessential to the mm. Call of Duty experience. Straight up. There's no mm. excuses yeah. as to why they should be broke. I mean, it, it should be just something as simple as fixing a line of code. It really should be. And with their yeah. 3,000, <laughs> 5,000, 8 million... Yeah, okay, listen, oh, God. I, I don't claim to have the knowledge, but, bro, like, uh, fixing by changing the code, though, like, it, it does take hell a lot of time, though. I, I, yeah, like, it's not like, uh, you know, you're opening a notepad and... Ooh, today I'm gonna change the code. It doesn't work like that. But the opposite point is also true. Like you are a multi-billion dollar company. You got three thousand. Right now it might be thirty-five hundred devs. Oh shit. oh shit! Yeah, right. Like they got thirty-five hundred devs, and three years or and they have blueprint of all the previous games. They have fans. They also have people giving them feedback left and right. YouTubers shilling and sucking their. C uh, you you feel what I'm saying? So. So like, bruh, like there is no excuse. Million dev team, Toys for Bob, Sledgehammer My Balls, Raven Software, Infinity Turd, Treyarch. I could probably name more than a. I, I don't even know certain devs that work there. I, I don't know yeah. certain dev teams that even work. Infinity War should never make another Call of Duty game. Period. Maybe campaign, but I like to believe that Treyarch can definitely make better campaigns than them. But all right, okay, they, they let them let them make campaigns. But the rest of it, give it to Raven, Treyarch. And then Sledgehammer my balls, and we can <laughs> we can keep Sledgehammer for listening to the fans though. I, I feel like that they do a good enough, decent enough job, better than other dev teams. I would put like Sledgehammer Games number one for listening to the fan base. Then I would put Treyarch, Raven there, uh, Infinity Tart. They never even listen, so it's like I don't even want to put them at the last spot. I just want to disqualify them. Just want to take them out of the, the 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 list real quick right there. Okay, they don't even listen. They don't even care. They don't even care. On Call of Duty FML, now because bro. there's so goddamn many. Like, okay, uh, can somebody fix it? What, what are these devs actually doing? Uh, I mean, why do updates get pushed out? They're sucking cow titties or sometimes they want to suck other titties too, but but like that that's what they're doing for the most part. <laughs> And, and your wallets as well, I forgot. Yeah, So your slow, as well. with more man and woman power than ever. Like, I don't get it. I truly do not get it. Why is the counter UAV, speaking of, why is the counter UAV, the same crappy counter UAV that you can just shoot with your gun that doesn't move for my- Friendly UAV ally! Once you have counter UAV, I'm gonna drop my friendly UAV online, son. I'm On just Warfare saying. 2. That's Worthless. Why. Worthless. The only reason it, it took me as long as it did to find it is because I was behind a big house on crappy estate. Let, let's just cover more here. So uh, they brought uh, back all the Modern Warfare 2 guns. That was a big selling point. Like, hey, your Modern Warfare 2 guns will carry over to Modern Warfare 3. And these losers just lost their mind. They just pissed their little britches. Oh boy, I get to carry over the same weapons I've been using all year into Modern Warfare 3. Bro, Call of Duty is one of the craziest franchises ever. I don't understand, dog. Like, oh my god, bro. Suckers would be paying $70 and Suckers would be playing with the same guns, same maps, three hours long campaign. I, although I do agree with a lot of people and I've gotten these comments and guys, like, listen, okay? Even I would not buy Call of Duty just for the campaign alone. I would never buy Call of Duty just for the campaign. I'd rather just watch it on YouTube, that's it. But the campaign is a soul. I am fine with, with Call of Duty not getting the campaign zone. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I am totally fine with it. But deep down, even I know, bro, like campaigns are the soul of the game. Black Ops 4 didn't have it. The game fell soulless. But you compare Black Ops 4 versus Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 4 felt miles better. 
which is absolutely insane to say because we thought like we would never go as low as Van Garbage and Black Ops 4 and Infinity War, Infinite Warfare, even though Infinite Warfare campaign was good. Zombies was also very decent as well. Multiplayer, it did not felt that good because of the multiplayer, uh, the, the, the time period for the multiplayer and the time setting. Like it was really future, the future. You know what I mean? It was one of those things. But Black Ops 4 uh, is miles better though. New content, remaster maps alongside it. Battle Royale was brand new with Blackout was really really good this game recycled completely three hours campaign they're continuing the storyline of modern warfare 2 completely it's clearly a dlc i would even as far as to say it's a patch let's be real the campaign uh you know they needed more time they really needed more time there are some decent missions but then there are some other missions that you look at and you're like brad like what are they doing right three hours long it's short af and also it's not impressive it's not gonna stick on your mind you're, it's not gonna be memorable like the old uh, call of duty games like black ops 1 modern warfare 2 uh the original modern warfare 1 as well even modern warfare 19 even modern warfare 19 was good even last year's campaign was uh, better than this crap they, they they dropped so it's not that it's not it's not necessarily that i'm gonna buy the game for the campaign i would never like i said but it's more like hey it, like they, they should have made it good and that is a clear indication that they that the fact that it was three hours long and it was missing content and it felt like rush that tells you that it was a DLC. Meanwhile, you know, they, they said, it's not a DLC, it's a full game, it's a full game. Uh, we promise that we've been working tirelessly, we've been working all year long, all three years long, with over 3,000 devs, and now we got 500 more, so it's 3,500 devs. And use them not for true. another year. Hip, hip, hooray! But the problem with that is, is that the Modern Warfare 2 weapons were just copied and pasted in with exactly. no balancing though. whatsoever. And from what I see, the from what I've weapons. seen on Reddit, everybody talking about them, they're all terrible. Oh, wait, what? You don't believe me? I mean, just look at this. Oh, my God. And now, some will say, like, you can't trust the bars and whatnot, but you can go look at the detailed weapon stats, which also. From what Ace, exclusive Ace said, are are wrong in some instances. Uh, it's flat out wrong. <clears throat> I don't get it. Modern Warfare 2 weapons are basically worthless. Don't even bother. Damn. I tried to use the TAC 56, I think it Damn. was, or one of the TACs, and it literally was like shooting through people. I, I don't know what was going on there. Uh, so How you have just this up, small bro. number of Modern Warfare 3 guns to use. Modern Warfare 2 guns were just haphazardly pasted in, and I can show you guys some Reddit stuff. A little later on, I guess, just comments. I was on Reddit all last night, just looking at all this stuff. In fact, I'll just, uh, I'll just do that now. Yeah. Oh wow! Look at oh this. my god! Oh I mean my god! <laughs> wow! Yeah! Thank you, Good Blame Truth. Thank you. This is all the stuff I upvoted just to show you guys, or, or come back to later. Um, anti cheat apparently doesn't work. A lot of people are saying they're they're running into cheaters pretty much constantly. They're saying that the Modern Warfare we 2 it. weapons are crap. Uh, more cheating stuff. This game needs combat pacing. It's something that, that was praised in Vanguard. Of Holy. course, these morons take it out and will probably never... Dog, i never seen something like this before. Holy, the entire Reddit is uh, overtaken by negative polls. And why can't we like it every single one of them? Here's a like, here's a like, here's a like. I like it, I like it, I like it, I like it. I mean, damn, okay, don't! That is crazy. Like the video, guys. Like the video as well. But damn, man, everybody's going off right now. This is the revolution, boys. If after this nothing changes, then it's Joe over. I, and that's another thing that I want to point out. The, the thing that I just said is ridiculous. Even I know it. You know it. We all know it. But I still said it. And I know some of you suckers are going to say it. Maybe not now. But later on, you're going to say it. And even I'm saying it, but it's ridiculous. It, it's the fact that next year call of duty is gonna be better we all say it but realistically though i think <laughs> next year i think it will be better Bumbaka! because it's gonna be true it is a whole lot of hopium i know it but bruh, i need a good call of duty game for once for once good zombies good multiplayer good campaign as well man see it agree. again did like, i not like the video if you agree say that did i not say they were gonna take it out we'll never see it again there you go eod padding again broken uh this guy's talking about how smgs suck from what i understand smgs are completely pointless in this game just use an ar there's there's no balance to speak of in regards to that so there you go um but yeah this guy's showing lag and Crazy bugs though. 
Uh, this guy is showing that the game is skipping mouse inputs. This guy is saying that there's no casual play to be had with the current matchmaking. This guy got kicked for inactivity for using a chopper, chopper gunner. gunner. Bumbaka! Uh huh. Bruh! Oh, no way. and the best part. The best part. Of course, go. I don't want to act like swag, but hey. I don't even know what a chopper gunner is, bro. Ghost or isn't working. AC-130. I don't know none of that, bro. But the best part here. Yeah. Rip. They just copied and pasted the firing range. Modern the dummies Warfare 2 have Modern Warfare 2 health. Another one. Not Modern Warfare 3 health. Crazy, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this is oh my god, bro! Holy mother of god, bro! They have copy and pasted the original mod or not original, but two two thousand uh, two, 2022 Modern Warfare Two dummy health. I can't, ladies and gentlemen. Recently, some suckers got caught in Modern Warfare Three playing without cheats for the first time ever, and this is how they played. And soon they got the cheats. They got the. You want to see what happened? Click on this video on the screen, and I will see you right.